Good evening. I'm Elizabeth Cook. And I'm Brian Yamamoto. We're getting a taste of how inflation can impact Bay Area workers. Hundreds of jobs in the South Bay suddenly wiped out as a frozen food plant is shutting down. Yeah, Amy's Kitchen makes frozen pizzas at a facility in Las Plumas Avenue in San Jose. KPIX 5's Lim Ramirez says the news came as a shock to employees who showed up to work this morning. Well, the company, Amy's Kitchen, cited ongoing supply chain issues and higher prices for ingredients as the reason for having to shut down this facility. But apparently that decision was made very quickly because employees coming into work today say they were blindsided by the bad news. Sí, todos estamos en shock. Alma Martinez came into work today and then was told to go home because she no longer has a job at the Amy's Kitchen frozen pizza plant on Las Plumas Avenue. Ayer vine a trabajar. She said she came to work yesterday and no one said anything about the shutdown. She's one of about 300 workers who will lose their jobs. Of course, it's sad. It's sad. <laughs> we already love the company. We, they, they, they take care of us, employees. They, they give us uh, everything that they, they can to, to make us happy, but it's sad. Amy's Kitchen says the plant was losing a million dollars a month because demand for its frozen pizzas is down, while at the same time prices for raw ingredients are up. Two of the main things that go into a pizza, flour and cheese, are up about 40 and 50 percent. We're all kind of getting killed a little bit by commodity prices right now. Chuck Hammer's Pizza My Heart has no connection to Amy's Kitchen, but the local chain does have 36 years in business and 25 restaurants. Hammer says the hit to the bottom line, especially when you add in higher employee costs, is significant. It's dramatically cut margins the first half of this year, so you know we just did a small price increase. We went up at 25 cents on, the, on slices um, just because we had to. And he says it's probably even harder on the frozen food side. When you're in supermarket, you don't have the ability to raise the price as much. I mean, they're they're fighting a real tight margin. It's closing down? Yeah. I'm not informed of that yet. Amy's Kitchen says it's trying to help its laid off workers with two months of severance. Quote, in addition to continuing employees' salaries and benefits during this transition, we have committed to provide all impacted employees with career placement assistance. The company also said its facilities in Santa Rosa, Oregon, and Idaho are unaffected and running at full capacity. In San Jose, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.